Here. Just open it. Right there. Boy! Oh my god, I don't believe it! <laughs> oh my god. Boy. Oh my god, I don't believe it. Oh, well, my instincts were totally wrong. <laughs> What is good everybody? Welcome to an epic My Damn Toys video. Today we are going to be revealing the gender of My Damn Child or My Damn Kid or whatever you want to call it. It is finally unveiled guys as you guys just saw in the last clip. It is a boy. Yes, me and Facewife are having a baby boy and we could not be more excited and we both thought she was having a girl. We thought for sure that we were going to have a girl. You know, I don't know what we thought. We were just thinking, you know, her symptoms and her pregnancy symptoms that she's been going through and uh, the heart rate of the baby and everything thing was just pointing towards, you know, all the folk tales and things of that nature were pointing towards a girl, and uh, that's false. We're having a boy, and you know what? We couldn't be more excited, more happy. Um, we we honestly, you know, we, we could not care less what the gender is. You know, we really do just are so happy with what we're getting, and, and we know that it is a beautiful, healthy, perfect child, and we are so excited for it, and we cannot wait to get deeper into this journey as parents as we take this on together, and I could not be more excited, and uh, I'm just super duper happy and I'm ready to go man but yesterday we had the gender reveal and uh, I wanted today's video to be about that you guys uh, you know you guys I know you guys support us a ton and you know you showed that support in the you know I'm a dad video I thought that was really excellent guys all the all the amazing comments you guys are so incredible and I appreciate you so very much for checking that out and, and wishing us you know congratulations and all the support you guys are absolutely amazing but Yesterday, we had our gender reveal party, just epicness. You know, we had my family, her family, our families together. You know, we are married. We consider each other one because, I mean, we have been together since 2010, and so it is 2019. We have been together nearly 10 years. We've known each other longer than 10 years, but uh, we have been together as a couple ever since 2010. We started dating when we were 13, 14 years old, and we are now 23, and so it is just amazing to see how far we've come. And um, we just continue to, you know, go on this adventure of life together, and I wouldn't have it any other way. She is the most beautiful, most amazing, funniest, incredible woman in the entire world, and now she will be the most incredible, loving, amazing, incredible mom in the world. So I am super duper happy. She is super duper happy, and we cannot wait for our baby boy. It's going to be freaking incredible. We do not have a name just yet. The name has not been unveiled. We're still mulling over the decisions and things of that nature. We want it to have the same initials as me, most likely. Um, that's not, you know, 100% fact that we want, but that is uh, what we're thinking. That You know, we want to keep that tradition. Me and my brother both have the same initials, so we wanted to keep those same initials. And um, we have some name ideas that we want to go with, but, you know, we can't fully agree on it. You know, nothing just sounds absolutely perfect to both of us. And we don't want to, you know, just go in with one of our decisions. We want to make this decision together. And we want it to be, you know, a perfect decision, and we want it to be good. We don't like anything basic, you know, Jackson and Jason and John and Jeremy and Jeffrey and all of those names right there. We don't like, I, I forgot to mention, we wanted to start with a J, but we want it to be unique. And so uh, we're, we're trying to think of a name there. So if you guys have a cool J name that you could think of, uh, comment down in the section. Uh, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Um, I have a name that I really like, and she has a name that she really likes, and we're going back and forth between the two. I don't want to unveil them, but maybe we'll unveil those uh, later on. But uh, I would love to know some ideas down in the comment section below, and uh, that would really appreciate it. But we have not decided on a name just yet. And again, the, the baby is coming in March 2020. And uh, we're very excited, man. We cannot wait. And another thing I wanted to point out is at the beginning, if you guys noticed that little uh, that little trailer that we had going, that trailer was actually uh, put together by us, and we showed that to our families. You know, we were just trying to make a funny little gig for our families to watch, so we showed that to our entire families, and then after that, um, everybody turned around, and me and uh, Victoria popped those little poppers, as you guys saw in those photos at the beginning, um, after uh, we unveiled it, and... Um, we popped that and everybody cheered, whatever. And a lot of people thought it was going to be a girl. Like, more than half of the people we asked thought it was a girl. I know in the community tab, everybody, you know, that was watching the channel, that's a fan of the channel, said, boy, I think 90% of you guys said it was going to be a boy. And you were correct. So that is pretty cool right there. I don't know if that's, if that's probably just because um, I have a majority of boys watching the channel. I'm not sure. I know we have female supporters here on the channel, but it's majority boy, definitely. It's probably like 80, 20, or 90 to 10, as the vote showed. But, uh, 
Uh, just really good stuff, man. Very exciting stuff yesterday. A lot of fun. Just an amazing uh, time with our family and friends as we all came together to celebrate this new life and this new adventure together. And uh, it's just really good stuff, man. Very excited. Again, I know I say I'm very excited, but it's just literally we're very excited. And uh, the video clip after the little trailer, um, that little video clip where uh, me and Victoria are in front of the camera reading it, the email, that is actually our first responses to our email we uh what we did was we did this little early testing deal where you can get you know your your uh blood drawn and stuff like that and you can see what your baby's gender is um weeks in advance now uh they don't have to do like an ultrasound of it they take your blood and they can actually see what the baby's gender is going to be so we did that and that was us actually reacting to the news in the email there sent from the doctor and uh, you guys saw what we thought uh just a big smile on my face because uh, it's just awesome, man. It's just awesome. Didn't matter if it was a boy or girl. I was going to be happy, and uh, I am freaking hyped. We're both hyped, and it's going to be epic. So a lot of you guys were correct on the boy. Boy is going to be playing with the figures, I'm guessing. Uh, even if it was a girl, they were going to be playing with the, the figures anyways, I'm sure. But now we get to get even more interesting. I mean, we're going to have a little mini MDT running around, and it's going to be insanity, but also very fun, very amazing, and I cannot wait for it. Uh, just, just really good stuff, man. The place we actually had the gender reveal was really epic, guys. I mean, you guys saw by the pictures. We had it set up like an actual uh, movie. Uh, it was like supposed to be like a movie pre premiere, and that's why we showed the trailer. So what we did is, uh, you know, we got all dressed up there, and we, we had like a little red carpet. You guys saw by the pink carpet, and we had it all decorated in blue and pink. Everybody made their vote. We had, you know, sort of like a like popcorn. We had corn dogs and cake and stuff like that. You know, try we had nachos, things of that nature. We wanted to have, you know, movie theater foods for everybody. We even had cotton candy and things so it was really epic really fun times with our families and it's just really enjoyable I had a great time with everybody and uh, I just loved it man so it was really exciting I loved every single second of it and I cannot wait to embark on to this uh, this fatherhood journey here with my beautiful wife and our family so what we're gonna do is uh, I, I believe we're just going to work on the next few days the next weeks and uh, try to come up with a name and as soon as we name it we will be letting you guys know and I would love to know down below in the comment section again uh, what you guys think for names I would love to know some name options down below remember JT uh, JTW is actually the initials we're trying to go with and we think that the middle name is going to be Trayton so if you guys have any cool names at the beginning to go with Trayton I would really appreciate it so J name Trayton White is what we're going with I have a name in mind she has a name in mind but we want to see if anybody else can come up with it or maybe you guys will mention the name that we have in our minds but if you have anything cool off the top of your head I would really appreciate it but that is going to do it for today's video guys I do believe if you guys missed yesterday's video we went over the top 5 MDT matches of all time we went over uh, my my personal opinion, my top five matches in the entire history of MDT. Really awesome video. We had the MDT Battle Royal a couple days ago as well, as well as MDT Vindication Episode 14. So if you guys miss any of that stuff, definitely go check it out on the channel. And uh, we are getting started on MDT Live 14. Going to be epic stuff. And then we will be on our go-home shows for Hell's Gate. And you guys know Hell's Gate is going to be absolutely phenomenal. And that is going to be uh, very true. Very true. Going to be a phenomenal pay-per-view. I cannot wait for it. Elite Championship on the line in the Elimination Chamber. MDT Championship on the line in the uh, in the uh, Elimination Chamber as well. And I'm going to try to um, I may do a video where I construct uh, you know the, the Elimination Chamber and I'm going to try and tweak it. And I'm going to try to make the walls taller and we'll see if we can figure that out. We'll see how that goes. But anyways guys, that is going to do it for today's video. I, got, I hope you guys did enjoy. Again, let me know down below what you're thinking on names. Um, did you correctly guess it? I'm guessing you did because 90% of you did, but that is going to do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.